DOGARMI is the acronym for the Oregon Department of Geology and Mineral Industries. We are the state geologic survey for the state of Oregon, and that means it's our responsibility to uh, create, compile, collect, and make available the geoscientific information about this state and this region for leaders to make policy decisions, for communities to uh, become safer and more prosperous, and ultimately for all Oregonians to be able to enjoy where they live. The U.S. Pacific Northwest is a um, spectacularly dynamic place geologically, and with that comes the geologic hazards. So in the U.S. Pacific Northwest, we have lots of mountainous regions. They're quite rugged. Uh, we get a lot of rainfall. When you take the intersection of a lot of rainfall with high rugged mountains, you tend to get gravity failure in the form of landslides and debris flows. Those are very frequent hazards. We have impacts from them every year. The first thing we need to do is locate where these landslides have occurred in the past or create a landslide inventory. Once we have the inventory, we can use that to create susceptibility maps or maps that show where they might occur in the future. Once we know where they might occur in the future, then we can direct uh, activities to reduce risk. Mount Hood is an active volcano. It is one of dozens of active volcanoes that we have in Oregon. Therefore, we are very interested in both what its future activity will be and what are those multiple hazards and how can we assess our vulnerability to them. Looking at the LIDAR data that we've collected throughout the state, we have stumbled over literally dozens of active faults that we had no idea existed in the past. This has really changed our understanding of where some of these earthquake hazards come from. Along with these large earthquakes that occur in subduction zone areas, we also have the secondary hazard, which is a tsunami. You know, instead of having a single tsunami evacuation zone, we have two zones. We map a uh, kind of maximum credible a uh, distant tsunami evacuation zone and a maximum credible local tsunami evacuation zone. People know that when they evacuate past the, the orange zone on our, our maps, they, they've gotten past the uh, point where there, there's any danger from distant tsunamis. There's at least four hours be, before one of those arrives. However, if they feel a big earthquake, then they know they have to go to the other much higher and much further inland zone the local tsunami hazard evacuation zone. And, uh, and they also know that that's only 15, 20 minutes before that or that arrives right after the earthquake. The Guami deserves a lot of credit for advancing the science of tsunamis and earthquakes. They have certainly have done a lot for Cannon Beach in the way of uh, making us more aware of the threat and the extent to which the wave uh, will be inundating the community and the heights of the waves, for example and uh, suggested evacuation strategies. We get super storms nearly every winter here, so we work very hard to monitor these type of uh, uh, coastal erosion and coastal uh, effects and be able to get that information out so that we can mitigate those impacts. We have essentially um, developed a, a long-term observation network um, that could be sustained now out into the future. Um, these stations provide valuable information about uh, the, um, the variability that's taking place on our coast. That's um, important for our, our sister agencies and the consultants that we work with periodically and the public at large. At Dogami, we're always looking at how we can new, use new and relevant technology to improve our uh, geologic mapping and our hazards interpretation. A technology that we have been using lately is LIDAR, which is Airborne Laser Ranging. And what this information does is it uh, develops a highly accurate elevation data that we can then turn into digital elevation models. LIDAR supports almost every aspect of what Dogami does. It provides detailed and accurate base maps that allow us to make more credible hazard assessments, better geologic maps, products we've never been able to make before. All of us at Dogami feel it's an honor and a privilege to be able to continue 
uh, helping Oregonians every day with being able to supply information and data and maps that impacts everyone's lives every day.